Hey yo, what's up everybody? Holmes here and welcome back to more Neo Boss Fight Guides video. Anyways, yeah, today we are going to be taking on the Great Centipede that's going to be in the mine. And um, this gets actually fairly easy um, if you don't stay in the poison mist. So here's the boss, there we go, looks all creepy and stuff. Um, first you want to go behind him, you don't want to lock on, just try to do as much damage to the, the back legs as possible because they're not actually attached to him. Um, when you damage them enough, they will break off. Uh, try to kill all of them, if you do manage to kill all of them, you can take the fight down here because um, if, if you don't kill all of them, they're going to run into these holes and they won't come out. Okay, there's, um, I don't know if there's any way to get out, I tried everything. That I can, um, they just won't come up, and they're gonna end up releasing this poison gas that's gonna flood the first floor. So if you're in the bottom, it's gonna there's gonna be poison all over the place, and you could activate the machines to get rid of the poison for like a couple of, for a few seconds or something like that, and then it's gonna come back. So it, it's kind of annoying. So what I like to do is just stay up here, and this is what you do: you pay him to do an melee attack so you want to watch out for the, the uh, projectile stuff so after he slams his head to the ground like that you get a couple shots in um, let's see if he shoots this this is a paralyzed fog so be careful if you get hit by it directly it's gonna paralyze you so I like to dodge back for that for this poison one I just got I just blocked it but you still take some little poison effect there um, you could dodge through it and get a couple of shots on his body. If you do end up going for those body shots, he will then try to crawl around, but just block and he'll get back up again. See, we'll go for bo um, body shots. He crawls, just block, because um, when he's crawling around, his fangs are gonna be pinching, doing the pinch attack. And you can just block it. The moment you block it, he gets back up. It's, it, it's kind of weird, but yeah, that's how you do it. So see, you go for that body shot. After you do a body shot, just get ready to block okay even if you get behind him get ready to block because he's gonna do that long pinching mouth weird thing that goes through his own body it's it's really weird it threw me off when he went through his body to turn around when I first fought him I'm like what the heck that doesn't make any sense but yeah that's that's how you beat the great sanity um, if you can't get rid of those things that spew poison just come up here and just stay over here and you know, get body shots, head shots, whatever. And this is how you beat him. There's no second phase or anything like that. I guess him trans like releasing the bottom part of him is the second phase. But yeah, it's better if you get rid of them. Because uh, if you're doing this tactic right here, you don't want those other legs to be interfering um, with this little tiny ass space. So yeah, this guy's pretty easy. Um, that's pretty much how I take care of it. Rinse and repeat. This is the thing about Neo, I don't know. Like the bosses, once you know their moves, it, it's really easy to get around. So I don't know if that'll change later on, but that's how it is for now. It's not like Souls where you have to be careful. Because they do random shit every time. And uh, yeah, there you go. Giant centipede or the great centipede down, and uh, yeah. So I thank you all for watching, and I hope this video has been entertaining and helpful and enjoyable. And if you all found all three of those qualities be in this video, then a stay tuned for more because there's gonna be more boss guides coming soon. But yeah, until then, I'll see y'all later. Homes out.